Hello and welcome to channel Unlocks Hub. Today in this video, I'll be showing you how to remove iCloud lock or activation lock permanently on an iPhone SE 2. This is an iPhone SE 2 running on iOS 17.3.1, which is an older iOS version. I'll be updating it to the latest iOS 17.4.1. This iPhone SE 2 is currently iCloud activation lock linked to an Apple ID and is also lost and erased. It is a product thread and I will be showing you how to remove the iCloud lock or activation lock permanently on this iPhone SE 2. Click on subscribe button and press the bell icon to get notified as soon as we post a new video. Do watch the video until then, do not skip any step. First step, click on smart flash option, then go to the pro flash option. Now enter DFU mode by following the on screen instructions. The phone failed to enter DFU mode. Just wait for it to turn on completely. We'll try one more time. Let me try one more time. And you can see it says DFU mode and iPhone SE 2 there. Make sure to check it says DFU mode. So first click on the check adapted SSH version. So once that is completed click on the import firmware option which is the third option and select the iPhone SE 2. 17.4.1 IPSW, you can see this unlocks hub. 17.4.1 iPhone SE 2 IPSW is imported and the current firmware. If you need the files, copy the email address given in the video description and email us right away. We are not available on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, Telegram, or any other social media applications. We are available on this YouTube channel and the email address given in the video description only. So copy the email address given below and email us right away. I've selected retain user data so the Wi-Fi passwords will be saved. Click on flash, click on yes and the installation begins. The whole process takes somewhere around 30 minutes. Do not unplug your phone at any point of time. Make sure to use the original Apple USB cable. If you have any doubts or questions, you can ask in the comment section. Click on subscribe button and press the bell icon if you haven't done that already. The installation has started, just wait for it to complete. Do not unplug your phone at any point of time. If you need the files, you know what to do. Just copy the email address given below and email us right away. If you have any doubts or questions, you can ask in the comment section. The installation is completed, it says flash complete there, just wait for the phone to turn on completely. Let me close this page. 
This is the second stage of installation. Just wait for it to complete. And the phone has finally turned on. Let me set it up quickly and find out if the iCloud lock is present or not. I'll be adding an Apple ID later, you have to do the same. And it finally says welcome to iPhone, click on the get started option and yes now we are inside the phone. Let me increase the brightness and yes, let me go to settings and it says sign in with your iPhone. You can see it is already logged into Wi-Fi that is because I selected retain user data. So if you select quick flash mode, everything will be completely erased. If you select retain user data, all the Wi-Fi passwords and other passwords will be saved. So make sure to click on the retain user data and click on sign in. You can log in with your own Apple ID and password or create a new Apple ID as well. So yes, this is how to remove the iCloud lock or activation lock permanently on an iPhone SE second generation running on iOS 17.4.1. Hit the thumbs up button if you like this video. If you need the package, you know what to do. Just copy the email address given in the video description and email us right away. Don't forget to click on subscribe button and press the bell icon to get notified as soon as we post a new video. Thank you for watching guys. Have a great day. Take care. Bye-bye.